Hello everybody. This is me, Melania. <sighs> My god. My god. I thought I would have much better news to be able to give to you today, but he just keeps doing the same things over and over again and he refuses to believe that he's not the president blah 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 I mean really <laughs> the whole world knows that he's not president anymore I just wish he wasn't my husband anymore and I could get my prenuptial of what is coming to me how much longer do I have to wait is that selfish I know you have had to wait too. You've been wanting to get rid of him now. It's been four years, so I do understand. So I'm hoping on January 28th that he actually has a little bit of change of heart and says, okay, I lose. It's very hard for Donald to say, I lose. He likes to say to other people, you lose. He said to me, uh, you lose many, many times. He said to Ivanka, you lose, you lose. He said to Marla, you lose, you lose. He said to Ivana, you lose, you lose. Everybody. Now, new CIA director, everything is up, up in arms. <sighs> One day this will all end when Biden comes in. You know, it's, it's inevitable. I don't understand why my husband wants to stay at a job that he hates. All he does is either go into the basement or he's watching the TVs until at least 11, 12 o'clock or he's uh, golfing. So it's not like he enjoys going to work. So I think he's just afraid he won't find another job. And it's what it is. So nobody would employ him. That's why he's, he's, he's his own companies which of course go into the big toilet, but that's a whole other story. So until that time, I will be in touch with you and I wish you all well with this COVID because it's getting a little out of hands, don't you think? Now it's like, all right, Donald, Donald, say something. Oh, you're such an idiot. Stay well.